the news at four o'clock. Very popular third party streaming application called UK Turk, which has been offline for a couple of weeks, now seemingly has made a return. But is the application safe? Well, looking on a couple of different online forums, and we can see that the latest version, which was released on the 6th of June, is version 1.1.5. And many thanks to Doc Squiffy, who actually shared the news of this new release. Now, to confirm or to check if any application contains any viruses, any malware, any key loggers, any crypto miners, anything like that, is to use the website VirusTotal. Now, you can actually install the application VirusTotal on your device as well. But if you have access to a computer or to a laptop or to a phone, you can just drag and drop the application into that website and it'll do that scan for you. Now here we can see I have downloaded the latest version on my device. And if I now go to VirusTotal, which is just VirusTotal.com, I can now get the latest version, version 1.1.5. And let's now drag that into VirusTotal so it can then commence the scanning. And as this file has been scanned before, we can see Quite alarmingly, it's coming up with 24 warnings or 24 flags. Now, I'm not necessarily saying that these flags are 100% malicious or a virus, but typically when you see such a high number, you can see why lots of people would be put off or potentially concerned with installing this application. So these warnings are from, I would say, very well-known engines like Avast, like Bitdefender, like AVG, like Google, like Semantics. So seemingly pretty serious warnings, but I will add the caveat one more time that in certain applications, in certain scenarios, if you are reverse engineering an application, if you're modifying the code in a certain way, that can raise flags in virus applications, but in reality, they are false positives. So I definitely do go ahead and check the warning alerts. I will leave a link to this virus total report in the video description and pinned comment if you wanna check this out. And for your protection, I do always recommend, especially with third party applications to use a VPN. If you are looking for a special offer on a VPN, I will also link that below if you guys are interested. But just some quick breaking news today because lots of you were messaging me about this application. I believe it was offline for a couple of weeks and initially it was due to uh, the developer moving server hosts or he was changing hosting packages. Now it does seem like the application is back. You can find it on your typical repositories like the APK time type stuff. Um, you can find the latest version in there if you're interested, but definitely do go ahead and double check and make sure you are happy with what you're installing. Maybe do the virus check yourself and just ensure that you know exactly what you're putting on your device. So that's pretty much the video guys. Many thanks for watching. Just some quick breaking news today. Do leave me a comment below if you are somebody that uses this application, if you are concerned about these alerts, and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.